Hey guys, Bizer here. Time to find out what's cooking in our next episode of the Daily Special. So today's Friday, which means it's Favorites Friday. So I figured that, you know, yesterday was Throwback Thursday, so we threw back to Generation 1 Pokemon. So I figured, why not today? Let's go to Generation 6. So today, for today's Favorite Friday, I am bringing Champion Diantha's Pokemon. And all of her Pokemon are, of course, Generation 6. So we'll have Generation 1 yesterday and Generation 6 today. So let's see how they do. So let's see what Diantha's Pokemon are. So... I am bringing an Assault Vested Gudra, so that thing can take special hits for days. We have our specially defensive Wally Aurorus um, with leftovers. We have our Mega Gardevoir, of course. We have our uh, Dragon Dancing Focus Sash Tyrantrum, so that way I can get up a Dragon Dance and then outspeed things and do some good damage. Then we have our uh, Power Herb Sky Attack Unburdened Halucha, so that way when I use the Sky Attack, Power Herb will activate, which will activate my Unburdened. So let's see how that'll work. And then we have our uh, Gorgice, which actually is Choice Banded. So this is a different Gorgice. This is a full uh, offensive Gorgice here with the Choice Band. So I'm not quite sure how that thing's going to be able to work. It's a super size one, so it's got the max attack, max HP. Um, so I don't know. We'll see. Let's go ahead and click that challenge button and um, see how it's going to go. I have no idea. So I'm hoping it does pretty good. I mean, we had uh, Throwback Thursday yesterday was pretty good. Got three wins, so hopefully today we'll get some wins. So we're actually facing Ash, it looks like. Alright, Ash. Ash is bringing a Greninja, a Rotom Wash, a Blastoise, a Dragonite, a Pinsir, and a Mawile. So three possible Megas. That's interesting. Um, I'm figuring, I'm assuming the Blastoise is Mega because it's Blastoise. But who knows? Um, so let's see here. Let's see here. We got special, 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 physical, physical. So we got three, three, three. Ah, who do I want to bring? Who do I want? Gudra takes care of Mawile, Pinsir, and Dragonite. So I should probably bring Gudra. We got the Halucha, which doesn't do much of Jack Diddly. Well, actually, the Halucha can take care of Pinsir. Oh, it's got the quick attack that'll kill me instantly. No. Uh, Gardevoir has got some things. Thinking, I'm thinking Gudra, Aurorus, and... and uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I want to lead with the Gudra. Uh, let's bring... Let's bring uh, Gudra, Aurorus, and... Let's bring... Uh, let's bring Gardevoir. Let's bring Gardevoir. Oh, yeah. Confirm. Confirm. Yeah. That's what we're bringing. So we're bringing Gudra, um, Aurorus, and Gardevoir to the first match of the day against Ash. I don't know how that's going to work. My Pokemon don't really match up quite well against his Pokemon, so I don't know. Who did I, did I pick Gudra to lead out with? I don't think I wanted to do that, but I did do that, didn't I? Pretty sure I misclicked. Yeah, I did misclick and clicked Gudra to come out first. I didn't want that. He's probably going to lead off with Owen. Oh, he's going to lead off with Greninja. So Ice Beam is coming my way. So I think I'm going to go for a flamethrower, predicting the ice beam. Um, yep, there goes the ice beam. I can tank that, no problem. Got the assault vest on. Let's see. Ooh, that does more damage than I actually wanted it to. It's life orbed. Um, flamethrower. See, so is that going to be able to take out the Greninja? No, it's really going to live? Are you serious? You're really going to live. You're really going to live. Greninja has paper thin defenses. You had life orb damage. Alright, so it's gonna ice beam. I'm gonna go into Aurora's to take the ice beam, because I don't want Guja to take any hits and I'll let him die via the the uh, life orb recoil. So I'll take a, some ch some damage from this ice beam. If he's gonna continue to do that, he is gonna go for ice beam again. Alright, so I resist that. That's nice. Do Wow, that does more than I actually wanted it to. Still, this is max special defense HP. And it's resisted, too. Man, Greninja's power. Alright, leftovers. Gonna get some lefty recovery. Let's see, who is he gonna send in? Who's he gonna send in? I got the freeze dry on this. Uh, so, he's gonna send out the Mawile. Okay. Okay. So, then Iron Head is coming my way. I don't see anything that I can do here. Um, 
Yeah. Go for damage, I guess. Yeah. Uh, yeah I'm gonna go for a Thunderbolt. I'm gonna go for a Thunderbolt. It's gonna Mega Evolve. I'm predicting a Swords Dance. I should have probably Calm Minded, but uh, yeah, I just decided to go for damage. Decided to go for damage. Oh, nope, just gonna go for straight Iron Head and kill me. That's uh, four times effective, and yeah, I'm dead. And it was a crit, because the crit super mattered. Uh, so he's got the Blastoise left, or he's, I don't know who he's got left, but... I don't honestly think that Gudra can take a hit from this Maul while, so I don't know why I'm going into it, actually. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go for fire. I mean, I've already shown I've got the flamethrower. Let's see. Uh, okay, he doesn't go for Sucker Punch. He's going for a Swords Dance or something. Let's see how much is this flamethrower gonna do. It does a decent amount. Can I get the burn? Nope. Clay Rough. So Gudra does out actually outspeed uh, Mawile. So that's good to know. Flamethrower is not going to be enough to take out the Mawile, unfortunately, which means that all I've got left is Gardevoir. Which, uh, it his steel resists my stab. So I'm going to trace this huge power. Oh, right. So now I can not Mega Evolve and go for the physical attacks, right? Alright. Um, yeah, I have to go for a Moon Blast straight off the bat. Let's go for a Moon Blast because everything I have is resisted by this small while. A Mega Evolve. Don't have the Hyper Voice because this is not from any of the previous generations, and that's the only way you can get a Hyper Voice Gardevoir. Um, is that going to just be enough to take out the Mawile, thankfully? Uh, let's go ahead and see who he's got left. Yeah, he's got the Blastoise left. Okay. Alright. Alright. So we got the Blastoise left. Uh, I'm thinking I'm going to set up a Calm Mind. I'm thinking I'm going to set up a Calm Mind. I'm going to set up a Calm Mind. Because Guard Mega Gardevoir has good special defense. Um... And this isn't a Mega Blastoise either, so that's good. I'm going to raise my Special Attack Special Defense. This is going to go for the Ice Beam. That's not Stab. That's not going to do much at all. And I'm just going to go for a Moon Blast now. No reason to start to keep doing Calm Minds. Just one is good enough, based on how much damage that does. That Moon Blast is going to almost be enough taken out as I lower its Special Attack, so now it's going to do even less damage. It's going to miss. doesn't even matter, though. Because it, re it really didn't matter, because it wouldn't have done that much anyway, especially with the special attack drop. All that good stuff, and he's just going to forfeit, because he knows he lost. Doesn't want to wait that extra 10 seconds for me to kill him, but whatever. Alright, forfeit, so we get our first win of the day, so that's good. Alright, so that's not bad, that's not bad. Yes, I do want to continue battling. Battle box. And click the challenge button, challenge, and let's find our second opponent of today. So, we are able to come through with that uh, the win today, luckily. Um, I can't believe that that Greninja survived the super effective flamethrower from a max special attack Gudra. I am honestly surprised with that, but hey, it happens apparently. We're facing Tyler, who's got a good old-fashioned Talonflame and a Kangaskhan. Oh boy, and we have a... what? Wait, what? He's got a Shedinja and a Charizard at level 23 and 39. And Halucha and A. Okay, I don't know what's what's going on there. Um, so I definitely want to bring Gudra in case he brings the the uh, Shin. Oh, actually, I'm gonna bring Gorgeist too. Um, but I don't know. All right, so Gudra. Let's see. Let's see. Kangaskhan. I probably want to bring Halucha for that bad boy. Um, don't want to lead with Halucha because I got the the stupid uh, Talon Flame. So that thing's gonna do poop damage. Uh, let's see here. I think I'm going to lead with Tyrantrum. Bring Halucha. And I need to bring Gudra, right? That's what I said, because it's got the flamethrower to, if for some reason, yeah, I'm going to bring Gudra. Bring Gudra. That's who I'm bringing. That's who I've decided to bring, and that's who I'm going to bring. Got it? Good. Alright, Tyler. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got, Tyler. With an interesting level 23 and 39 Pokemon. I seriously, seriously doubt they are bringing them, but I don't know. Who knows? Maybe he'll do that in the Wonder Garden. If I don't have anything that's super effective against it, well, then I'm screwed. Uh, I'm going to lead off with the Tyrantrum. Is he leading off with the good old Talonflame? No, he's going to lead off with Kangaskhan. Alright. Kanga, 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 Kanga. I cannot 
Dragon Dance because you got the Sucker Punch. And I don't like that. Are you going to fake out? You might just fake out too. Uh, so let's see, what's going to be stronger? Dragon Claw or Crunch? They're actually going to do the exact same amount. So I'm going to go for a, dra a Stone Edge would be stronger. I'm going to go for a Dragon Claw and see how much damage that does. I can't Dragon Dance because if he's got, the, he's got the Sucker Punch, then I'm screwed. Uh, and he's got the, yeah. He's going to fake out like I thought. Didn't bring the Gore Guy, so I couldn't switch into that. Figured you're gonna fake out. Yeah, flinch. Um, you know what? Screw it. Let's dragon dance. Let's dragon dance. He's probably gonna power up punch. Yep, that's what I thought. So let's see. Ah, uh, double sucker punch is gonna kill me. Ah. Uh. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Is he gonna sucker punch? Is he gonna sucker punch? Is he going to sucker punch? A plus two sucker punch will probably kill me at this range. I don't have any choice. Yep, that's what I thought he was gonna sucker punch. Should've dragon danced again. Yep, oh, because he gets a crit too. Because he really needed that crit. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Halucha, come in and do a good old fash in uh, high jump kick. Actually, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna home class. I'm gonna home class. I'm gonna home class. Don't know what this. I don't think this Kangaskhan really has anything for me. So you know, I'm gonna home closet up. I'm gonna home closet up. You might predict the high jump kick and switch out, which is entirely possible. And I'm gonna get a home claws off. And, uh, yeah, he's going to switch off, so I'm going to get a free home claws off, so that's good. So he's going to go out into the Aegis Slash, predicting me to go for the high jump kick. Look at that. That. Do we have the Sky Attack that'll do resisted damage? Uh, let's see, he's got Shadow Ball, all that good stuff. All that good stuff. Hmm. 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 All right, let's just go for the sky attack. Let's activate our power herb. Did not go for the uh, the king shield. Oh, sky attacks animation. That's interesting. That was a plus one too. It's resisted though. All right, it's gonna stance change. And what are you going to do? Oh, he got- I got the flinch! Ooh, alright, so he's most likely going to King Shield, so I'm gonna go for a, uh, Hone Claws, cause now all I got left to use is Stone- oh, he's not. Damn it, should've attacked. Should have attacked. He's gonna use Aerial Ace. Oh, I'm dead. No, oh, I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Alright, so he has to King Shield. He's got a King Shield. I'm gonna go for the Stone Edge. Yeah. Ugh, I was this close to clicking Hone Claws. That close to clicking Hone Claws. Had I uh, Hone Claws it up, then I'd be at plus three. Uh, yeah. Alright, I'm still at plus two. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Alright, let's go for the Stone Edge. Don't think I'm missing because my accuracy is at plus two. That's plus. Oh my god, that does pathetic damage. That does pathetic, pathetic damage. When he switched into Aegislash, I should have immediately switched into Gudra. I should have immediately switched into Gudra. Uh, uh. Oh well. Well, let's go for the flamethrower. It's gonna stance change most likely. Anyway, yep, King Shield. King Shield had I had I like burn or a uh, Will O Wisp for some reason because you know Gujra runs Will O Wisp. Uh, I would have killed. I would have been able to take him out, or that would have went through the uh, through the King Shield. Um, 
Let's see, is that going to be enough to take him out? Yes, thank you. At least it will be enough to take out the Aegislash. Well, at least we're not getting 3 would But he still has good old Kangaskhan, which can come through and destroy me. Yep, there's the Kanga. There's the Kanga. There's the Kanga, the most, uh... The most skilled using Pokemon, the most skilled, only the most skilled people can use a Kangaskhan. Really, really. And I will not be using the Kangaskhan ever. Not even on Try Hard Tuesdays, cause just because Kangaskhan is so broken and it takes absolutely no skill at all to use him. Um, it really doesn't. Especially when you have a set like this, the Power Up Punch, Fake Out, Sucker Punch thing. I mean, yeah. It takes no skill to use it, so. I will not even on Try Hard Tuesday, I will even do it. Um, I mean, I used Tal Brave Birding Talonflame once. I don't think I'll bring him back. Maybe. I might bring him back, but, uh, yeah, so fake out. Obvious fake out is obvious. Um, yeah, and he's probably going to power up punch right now, too. Or, yeah, he's probably going to power up punch right now, too. Nothing I can do, but just sit here and talk. Oh, no, he's just going to go up for sure for the second punch. It's not going to take me out, but I seriously doubt a Dragon Pulse will take King's Gone out anyway. Um, yeah, nope. See, I mean, see what, look how bulky this thing is and how just, it's so stupid. It's so broken. So, it's a broken Pokemon. Um, yeah, but, yeah, whatever. People will always use them because it's available, and, you know, that's how it's going to work. So, we lose against Tyler, so we're going to go one and one right now. Um, so let's go ahead and get our final match of the day going here. No, I do not want to save the battle video. Thank you very much. Yes, I do want to continue battling. And battle box. And let me click the challenge button. Challenge button. And let's find our third and final opponent of today. And see how that's going to turn out. So we're facing Cordy. Battle no legend. I don't know what that means. Does that mean he doesn't use legendaries? He's got a uh, Telfox, a Gorgeist of his own, and a Gudra of his own. So we're sporting two of the same Pokemon. And a Skarmory, and a Metacham, and a Greninja. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, 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 alright. So, let's see here. Let's see here. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? Go out into the Tyrantrum. I can set up a Dragon Dance. And what does that do for me? It's gonna be ice. And go for the stone edge. Yeah, that's possible. Yeah, alright, it's Hyrantrum. Gorgeist doesn't do anything. Gorgeist doesn't do much of anything. I mean, it's got his Gorgeist. I have like one speed investment in my Gorgeist, so I might be able to outspeed his. You know what? I'll just bring it. Bring that, and let's bring Gardevoir. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. I don't care. I'm doing it, and I don't care. I'm doing it, and I don't care. That's who I'm bringing. That's who I'm bringing, and that's who I'm sticking with. That is who I'm bringing, and that is who I'm sticking with. So if I Dragon Dance, and he takes me down to that, I'll probably kill him next turn. Uh, he's going to lead off with Skarmory. Alright, that's interesting. So I lead out with Tyrantrum. Alright. Alright, that's an interesting play. Very interesting play. I'm going to go for a Dragon Dance. Um, Stone Edge is neutral on this because he's flying. Set up a Dragon Dance. Let's see, what does he want to do? He is going to... Is he talking about his curse? Okay, so we're playing this, are we? So it's got Sturdy. I got Focus Ass. So right now we're in the same boat. So I just went plus one attack. He just went plus one defense. So they those neutralize each other. So let's see how much is. Ooh, that stone is just gonna do a lot because it was a crit and he's gonna toxic. So that's fun. Um. So this stone edge should finish him off. The Stone Edge should finish him off. Land it. Good. Thank you, Stone Edge, for landing. That should take out the Skarmory. What? Okay, what? How did... No, no, no. That was... The last one was a crit, and that... What was that? No, 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 no. I am sorry. No. That is no. That is utter garbage and not... That Skarmory should be dead based on how much HP it had left. This Skarmory should be dead. 
Uh, okay. I'm gonna Dragon Dance again. That Skarmory should be dead. I had to get, I had to have gotten absolute max damage last time, and then absolute minimum damage this time. Yeah, figured it was gonna roost again. So I'm gonna spam uh, some up, some. Uh... Oh, right, because the crit ignores the defense boost. Totally forgot about that. Totally forgot about that. Um. Forgot about that. Alright, let's Stone Edge now. Land it. This is plus two now. How much is that going to do? It's going to set up a curse again. Alright, so now let's see here. So I need to get a crit with this stone with the Stone Edge in order to take out the Skarmory right now because he just cursed it up. Come on, Stone Edge. Stone Edge crit. Stone Edge crit. Come on, you're high critical. You're high critical. You're not going to give me the crit. It's going to go for a drill peck. It's not going to take me out, but the toxic will kill me. Ah, I totally forgot that crits ignore the special defense increase. Darn it. Uh, I have to go into Gardevoir and go for a Moonblast. It's resisted, but it's at low health. Don't have any other choice. Don't have any other choice. The trace it's sturdy. After Mega Evolve and go for a Moon Blast. Don't have any other choice. Don't have any other choice. I gotta hope that this kills. I gotta hope that this kills. I know Skarmory is physically defensive, so... Let's see, this is on the special side. Is it going to be enough to take it out? It is going to be enough to take it out. Luckily, it was at low enough health, so that's good. So we got Gardevoir in here now. At least Gardevoir is at max health right now. Let's see who he's going to bring in. Going to the Delphox. Smart play. Resist everything. Uh, let's see here. It's gonna go for a fire. What was the last Pokemon I brought? Oh, I brought Gorgai, so that's useful. <laughs> that's useful. I'm gonna set up a Calm Mind, actually. Set up, start setting up some Calm Minds. Why not? Why not? Let's see, it's gonna go for the Mystical Fire. Oh, that lowers my special attack, doesn't it? It's alright. It's still neutral, so I'm gonna go for another Calm Mind. I'm gonna just keep buffing up my special defense. Just gonna keep buffing up my special defense. So he can go for a missile fire all he wants, and it'll just uh, my attack, my special attack will just be neutralized. And he gets oh my god! Let's see here. Why did that do more? I set up another calm mine. So I'm confused as to why that was doing more. It's confused it. So we're at plus three special defense now. So I'm gonna use so oh, Psy Shock now. Alright, so I resist that. That's gonna okay. Now I definitely have to attack. I'm at plus three. I go for the hyper beam. I go for the hyper beam. I don't think a moon blast will kill. I'm gonna go for the hyper beam. I'm gonna go for the hyper beam! Hyper beam! Pixelated hyper beam! At plus three. Is that going to be enough to kill? It will be enough to kill. It was a crit, too. Dang it, maybe if I had gone for Moonblast, uh, if I had gone for Moonblast, the crit would have killed, most likely. Darn it! Alright, so he's going to go into Metacham. Alright. So I have to recharge, so he can get a free whatever the heck he wants to do. Um, it's going to Mega Evolve, and... Things and stuff. Uh, so let's see here. Let's see here. Just gonna go for. Or just gonna go for. The, say fake out. Just gonna take out my guard of war because I had to recharge. Darn it! Had I known I was gonna get the crit. <laughs> All right. Well, we're in guard ice now. Um, I'm gonna frisk his. Oh wow, his Metachamite. No way. No way. Uh, let's see here. So, Phantom Force is my strongest play. 
I think I'm gonna have to, yeah, I'm gonna lock myself into Phantom Force. It's gonna go for the, oh, it's got Ice Punch. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no, I live. I live. So it all depends on how much damage this is going to do. Can't protect, can't do nothing, can't detect. We go for Ice Punch, Miss, Phantom Force, Choice Banded, Max Attack. This is super effective. Is that going to be enough to take it out? Gorgeist! Offensive Gorgeist for the win! Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. Alright. So Gorgeist coming through with that Phantom Force win. That's why you got a Choice... Choice banded Gorgeist, man. Choice banded Gorgeist. Alright, so thanks guys for watching. That was two wins. We got two wins, one loss, so not bad for Diantha's team. It's alright, so, you know, what can you do? I'm, I'm okay with two wins. I will take two wins and one loss. Loss? One loss. One loss. One loss. Um, so, thanks you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to click the link down below. Follow me on Twitter because that's where I'll be posting all my updates and all the good stuff about this channel, when I upload videos, where you can challenge me for battles, all that good stuff. So, again, if you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, and sub subscribe. Let me English that again. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys later.